The push for change continues across the country. For the last month, people have taken to the streets calling for an end to police brutality and racial injustice, and that includes here in Hampton Roads. But one protest in Norfolk today looked a little bit different from most that we've seen recently. 10 on your side's Tamara Scott explains. Well, this wasn't the same type of protest that we've been seeing over the past few weeks. Today, these men were dressed head to toe in suits and ties, and they said it's because they want to send a message of unity. I just feel like I should be out here with these men out here having having fun. In Josiah Kelly's eyes, marching with the men in his community today was fun. But of course, it served a bigger meaning. We want to show the professional look that we can also do, right? Suits is a way that we can kind of project that we are men of influence, men of power. Five black men in Norfolk came together for a march celebrating black men and what they stand for. Every single one of them dressed to the T. Makes you feel good. You know what I mean? If your head is down, you know you got some black brothers behind you to help you lift your head up no matter what's going on. Shelby Gatewood says wearing a suit sends a message. They hope to change the narrative. To me, it empowers a different look than what you usually see on the news. You usually see someone with a hood on, face covered up, um, looting, doing everything wrong. We want to show the positive side of a black man. Alvin Holloway believes the positive side is not always shown. Shoot them up, bang, bang, that's all you see. Individuals that look like us, uh, we're business owners, we're family men, we're everyday people. Everything you see on the news at late night is depicted, depicts us as uh, or with negative connotations. You know, we're more than meets the eye. It's for the community, but they're really here to catch the youth's eye, and they're not missing a beat. We should stand up for these people and stand up who's for going through all this stuff, like this corona, this all these police. We need to, we need to feel, we need to feel good for our people out here going through this struggle. Now the organizers told me that this isn't the first time they've held a march like this and they're actually looking to plan another similar march in the near future. They told me today that they hope people left today feeling encouraged and inspired to help lift up the black men in their community to make it a better community. In Norfolk, Tamara Scott, 10 on your side.